For today's Halloween DIY video, I'm going to show you how to make a rotten severed toe using Elmer's glue. And you're going to be using your own toe as a mold, so make sure that you shave any extra little hairs off of there before you start. So the first step is take a small brush, dip into the Elmer's glue, and completely coat your toe in a thin layer of glue. Then once you're done with that, go get a blow dryer and dry that first layer. And you're going to want to repeat this about four to five more times until you have around five layers built up onto your toe. Then make sure everything is completely dry and now is when you're gonna start removing it. First, take some baby powder, gently rub it all over your toe, and then start pulling up from the bottom all around the base of your toe and work it up towards the tip of your toe. And you're gonna to wanna to be very careful with this step just to make sure you don't tear any of the glue. Then just gently keep rolling it up to the top until it's completely off of your toe and the inside is now on the outside. Now to give this mold a little bit of stability, you're going to want to take some cotton balls and put those on the inside. Those will keep it bulked up. And then we get to the part of sealing it. For this, I used hot glue and I put a ring all around the inside edge. And you got to make sure none of the walls touch each other. Otherwise, that is going to completely screw up everything and you're going to have to start back at the beginning. Now, once that ring has dried, that's when you fill in the rest of the toe area. And then to get the little tendony meaty parts coming off of it, I just took a thumbtack, dug into the glue and gently pulled it out until I get little strands coming off of it. And the last step is the coloring. All I used was a little bit of wood stain, brown wood stain, and coated the entire thing in the stain. And since it is stain and it is October, it takes a little bit longer to dry, so I let it sit overnight. And that seemed to be pretty good. It was still a little bit tacky in the morning, but a day or two and this should be totally fine. Then for the toe tag, I didn't make this myself. I just went to makeyourownimitations.com, printed out one of their templates on some thicker cardboard paper, cut that out, punched a hole in the top, and attached it to the toe with some twine. And you could also use other things to attach it. You could use string, you could use a metal wire, whatever you want to do. And then just to make it look a little bit older, I crumpled it up. And there you have it. That's how I made this rotten severed toe. It took about an hour for the molding and painting process, not counting drying time. And I think it looks really good. The glue picks up all of the texture in my toe and the toe prints and the nail looks smooth. It looks like a real toe to me. And you can also use this probably for anything else too. You want to make a nose, just be sure not to get glue in your nose. You want to make a finger. I'm sure it will work for those too. So if you enjoyed the video, remember to like and subscribe. And if you love all things Halloween, horror movies, and monsters, be sure to check out some more of my videos in the future.